Thank you. I'm very pleased to uh, welcome you here. Uh, Czech Republic has been uh, very, very strongly supportive of Israel through uh, good times and dark times. This is our darkest hour, and I appreciate the fact that you're standing here. Your support is invaluable, and I welcome you to Israel. I always say that uh, standing with Israel, uh, there's only one thing better than that, and that is standing in Israel, and that's what you're doing. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Prime Minister. I came here in this difficult time to express our clear support and solidarity with Israel. We had a plan to meet in Prague Indeed. at uh, October the 8th, and, but one day before, Hamas and Palestinian terrorist organizations started their barbaric terror. October 7 was the most tragic day for Israel and Jewish people for decades. One Czech citizen was also a victim mm -hmm. of this act of terror. The pictures and videos which we have seen are shocking, really shocking. These acts of violence have no place in our world. I want to make it very clear Czech Republic stands with Israel, now and ever. And like 75 years ago, you can count on our voice and support. I am glad that Czech companies immediately supplied basic military equipment to Israel. Mm -hmm. Specifically, it was uh, 3,000 pieces of ballistic plates, and we have option to send more. Israel has an absolute right to defend its, uh, itself. Terrorists still have more than 200 hostages. I feel deeply with all families. The international community, community must push there for their unconditional release. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to Brussels to the a European Council meeting. And my goal is to ensure that the Council confirms a strong support for Israel and its right to defend itself. Hamas is our common enemy. We must ensure that it is, is isolated and uh, it is on EU terror, terror list for years, mm -hmm. and now we must act. So, dear Prime Minister, Israel can count on Czech Republic. We are with you as we always have been. Thank you, Peter. Thank you.